Robertson. Thank you, Mr Deputy Speaker. Mr Deputy Speaker, I share the member for Lin Lin Giari's sentiments and I join with him today to express the gratitude of the Central Coast and indeed of our nation to Lance Corporal Todd Chidji. We express our deep sadness and our sorrow at the death of a fine soldier who died in Afghanistan on the 1st of July. May I take this opportunity to express my deep condolence to Lance Corporal Chidji's parents, to his brother and to his partner. All Australians share their grief and our hearts go out to them. There is no greater sacrifice an Australian can make than to give his life in the service of his country. Lance Corporal Chidji was held in high regard by his unit at, in Afghanistan and by his mates. His loss will be felt deeply by all who knew him as a loyal mate and a talented and professional soldier. His colleagues have described him as a brilliant bloke to know and work with, loyal to the core and someone who would do anything for his mates. Serving as part of the Protective Security Detachment, he was considered a consummate professional and a hard-working, dedicated soldier. Lance Corporal Chidji deployed on six tours to Afghanistan, ranging from two weeks to six months, and he never sought recognition or reward. Yet, since joining the Australian Army in 2006, Lance Corporal Chidji received a number of honours and awards. Mr Deputy Speaker, we have indeed lost one of our finest. In the words of Special Operations Commander Brigadier Dan McDaniel, at a solemn ceremony at the Royal Australian Air Force Base in Richmond last week, Lance Corporal Chidji was loyal, diligent and committed to the service of his country, his mates and his family. Brigadier McDaniel said he will be missed but never forgotten by the 2nd Commando Regiment and the wider Special Operations Command community. May I add, Mr Deputy Speaker, that he will also never be forgotten by the people of my electorate of Robertson, by the people of the Central Coast, who know and respect the contribution of soldiers, past and present. 29-year-old Lance Corporal Chidji was born in Gosford and the funeral service took place yesterday on the Central Coast. I understand there are around 450 mourners in attendance, including the Prime Minister Tony Abbott and the Leader of the Opposition, Bill Shorten. These moments remind us all of the great bravery, courage and dedication of the men and women of the Australian Defence Force. All operational deaths are a tragedy. Today, my deepest condolences are extended to Lance Corporal Chigi's family, friends and fellow soldiers at this very difficult time. His colleagues in Afghanistan are also in my thoughts. Their contribution to peace and to our national security will forever be remembered. May he rest in peace.